Mr. President, can you just make clear right here, what do you or what did you want President Zelensky to do with regard to Joe and Hunter Biden? If you look at what he said, okay, and he brought it up. I think he brought up the name Rudy Giuliani. What I want is the following, and I've said this loud and clear. We have our ambassadors here. We have Mike Pence here. Why are we the only ones that give the big money to the Ukraine? We give money to Ukraine, and it's bothered me from day one, and you have plenty of people just here. I say, how come it's always the United States that gets ripped? Frankly, Ukraine, we want to help them. And I do like the new president. You know why I like him? Because he was honest. Because he said there was no pressure at all exerted on me, meaning him, by the President of the United States. He said it. By the way, that one sentence should stop this. But he said there was no pressure exerted. But you don't have to ask him. All you have to do is read the transcript, read the telephone call. But what I was having a problem with are two things. Number one, Ukraine is no before him for tremendous corruption. Tremendous. More than just about any country in the world. In fact, they're rated one of the most corrupt countries in the world. And I don't like giving money to a country that's that corrupt. Number two, you don't like giving I said, money. excuse me, number two, I said the following. And I said this loud and clear to everybody. And in fact, Rob Portman backed me up. And there's nobody more honorable than Rob Portman of Ohio. Because he called up, please let the money go. I said, Rob, I hate being the country that's always giving money when Ukraine helps Europe and the European countries far more than they help us. They're like a wall between Russia and Europe. They're like a wall. They're a big, wide, beautiful wall. And he said, you know what, but it's important. And he, in fact, he came out and he said that. That was my only reason. Because I don't like being the sucker country. We were the sucker country for years and years. We're not the sucker country anymore. But I gave the money because Rob Portman and others called me and asked. But I don't like to be the sucker. And European countries are helped far more than we are. And those countries should pay more to help Ukraine. Ask a question, please. Thank you, sir. Mr. What, about, what about Mr. Biden? What, what did you want about Biden? What did you want him to look into on Biden? Look, Biden and his son are stone cold crooked. And you know it. His son walks out with millions of dollars. The kid knows nothing. You know it, and so do we. Go ahead, ask Just, a question. But the, the question, sir, was what did you want President Zelensky to do about Pres Vice President Biden and his son, Hunter? Are you talking to me? Yeah, you it was just a follow-up of what I just asked listen, you, sir. Listen, you ready? We have the president of Finland. Ask him a question. I have one for him. I just wanted to follow up on the one that I asked you, which did was, you hear what me? did you want Did you hear me? Yes, ask sir. Ask him a question. I, I will, but I've my... given you a long answer. Ask <laughs> this gentleman a question. Don't be rude. No, sir, I don't want to be rude. I just wanted you to have a chance to answer the question that I asked I've you. I've answered everything. It's a whole hoax. And you know who's playing into the hoax? People like you and the fake news media that we have in this country. And I say, in many cases, the corrupt media, because you're corrupt. Much of the media in this country is not just fake, it's corrupt. And you have some very fine people, too. Great journalists, great reporters. But it, to a large extent, it's corrupt and it's fake. Ask the President of Finland a question, please. Okay, I'll move on now.